Okay. I'm excited about this episode. This was fun. Me too, actually. What's happening? It's your kill Tony recap. It's Copus Millenni. Erica Lisa. Seth Lawrence. Hey. Abraham Boche. And we got our first special guest. Yeah. Devontae Green, guys. Yeah. <laughs> Devontae Green. You guys Green. are talking closer to the Thanks mic. Thanks for having me, guys. Yeah. Devontae Green. Thanks for having me. We're excited to have it. you on, Devontae. You had a rough night tonight. What you got to say about it, buddy? Just come uh, out the gate with you it, You get man. 60 seconds. I'll tell you, Just listen. Uh, you can't <laughs> win them all or any. You know? <laughs> <laughs> what come does on. that mean, bro? I happen to think you did really well. Uh, well, you know, uh, listen, okay. I live my life by the motto, you can't win them all or any. You know, we uh, we went out there, we gave them our best skip, uh, 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 but really the other team won today is what happened, you know what I mean? How what? much do you hate black people right now? Oh, I love black people all the time. I, know, I, I, I Listen, we, 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 you can't win them all or any. All right. Well, here's, the <laughs> all thing. Right. here's the thing. Do you think that people, why do you think people get so mad at you, though, about the black thing? I think there's a lot of variations going on at the at that room, but uh, you know, I, I don't I, I don't spend too much time. Uh, I can't. Everybody's got their own perspective. Why are you being so something? careful? with people are mean to you, dude, fuck them. <laughs> just <laughs> just Aphrodite uh, tried to just fight let you it last out. Time. Just you know let it out. Oh, I, and I forgot I, about that. Everybody's got their own opinion. We're all running our own race. We all got to be our own comedian. So you know, everybody yeah. should shut the fuck up and uh, suck my dick from the back. Oh, <laughs> 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 right. Yes, that goes for white comics, That's black close. comics, oh, air comics, That's Jewish comics, for. gay <laughs> comics, straight comics, lesbian comics, transgender comics, fat comics, women comics, men comics, uh, Pikachu comics. That goes for everybody. I want you to know I am open for you to suck my dick from the back. Nice. That's just the way it's going to go. Right. You know what I mean? Devante fuck you. Yeah. I you gain my respect. That on stage, bro. That's Green. what you need to say on stage. That's what the fuck you need to say on stage. Throwing if you would have said that on stage tonight, that would have fucking killed, bro. Maybe. Well, I like how I like Maybe. how I mean I, I like your it's a energy. 50 No, I think it would have killed. But man. I like that energy a lot though. Well, you know, you know, listen, man. Sometimes you gotta be very careful for sponsorships and uh you know, you know, listen, man, you know, you, you can't win them all the... or any. Remember that. You can't win them all or any. Do you think that someone's gonna offer you a sponsorship That's a bad at Kill Tony? I think that if you aren't fucking paying attention to the fact that everybody's always watching you. Like, you know what I mean? Like it's yeah. cute for one night. Right, for Talking one, to the mic. it's cute for one night. It's cute for one second. Uh, but whatever we say, you know, whatever you do say, as you can tell, comes back in ten years, and so you're responsible for what you say. So tonight, I do feel like you know uh, we got ourselves in a bit of a pickle. But uh, I don't care when we look back on it. I'm like, all right, I gave myself a fighting what, chance. What, fuck all that. Last time you were talking about your roommates are gorillas and shit, and yeah. that's what set everybody off. That's what they didn't oh, bring yeah, up today. That's, right. that's what Tony remember. wanted to remember mm. was that you called your roommates are gorillas, and I thought it was fucking hilarious because you know what the fuck you're talking about you know what the fuck you're saying yeah. and these motherfuckers that are taking it to another level fuck them just like you said they can suck your dick from however the fuck but i want to talk about i want to talk i want to talk about your slave feet <laughs> there you go you I, feel it. So I like that kind you. of energy Bro. yeah he made the comment that he has slave feet that is not Abraham being That was racist. fucking hilarious. He made a comment about he fucks with his socks on, and I feel you on that one, bro. Because, uh, yeah, yeah, my, the other day really? my girl tried to take my socks off, and I fucking bopped her in the house. I was like, bitch, what the fuck are you doing? <laughs> is that is that a minority uh, thing think my or what? Alone. Well, if no, you watch like not. a lot of like black porn, the guys keep their socks on. Well, no, it's not that. I think it's because we got crocodile that's feet. What I've that's said. what it is. We got what? crocodile feet. But well, why part are of white privilege? Let's black? talk about what white privilege might be. Okay? Oh gosh. I want you to understand this. Okay, white, what is that? White privilege is walking around with your toes freely. Okay, nobody needs <laughs> that. Nobody wants that. Nobody asks for that. But white people force that on you. Okay, let's talk about rape culture. You rape your toes on me, and I don't want it right there. Okay, everybody else covers <laughs> their toes. Cover your fucking toes. Okay, that's all I say. I don't want nobody's toes. All right, I don't like no feet. Nobody's feet whatsoever. Socks are for feet. Keep them covered. Mexicans never wear shoes. <laughs> they don't even wear shoes when they mow the lawn. No, fuck that. I wear my socks. Hell with my, no. When I go to the beach, I still wear my fucking socks with my sandals. You guys have got to be kidding no, fuck me, that. dude. Man, my All grandpa right. never wore fucking shoes. <laughs> he worked at the Department of Water and Power, and he went there with no boots. Oh my just god! Fucking okay. Big yeah. ass right. toes. See, stereotypes already disproven. <laughs> Instant. That's wow. the best thing about stereotypes. They're true until they're not, because they're never. Wow. True. I don't think that anyway. That's not true. We like to wear our our sandals with our socks. Last time I tried to go to the beach and try to show off my toes, fucking I tried to feed the seagulls. They just fucking looked at the bread, looked at my toes, and they okay. fucking flew away. <laughs> All right, we got okay. Abraham doing his set. Abraham's over here. doing, Abraham his, doing his, his set. But let me ask you guys this question. Let me ask. Sign uh, up for a, a slot, Abraham. This would be a fundamental <laughs> question, right? Yep. Okay. 
why do why do 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 you all or anyone feel qualified to tell me what I'm qualified to say out of my mouth? Why do you sound mm. like Bill Cosby? Oh my gosh! Because he's a very intelligent what? person. What just happened? <laughs> <the things laughs> what just happened? <laughs> I don't know, but uh, like, I, 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 like that's a legitimate question, right? Because if you can, yeah. like, we can say, hey, people felt uncomfortable about the gorilla comment. I would say the rebuttal would be, what is your qualifications to tell me what I can say out of my mouth? Exactly. I have zero. I love that. Yeah. No, I don't. Yeah. Think yeah. That's, I, I'm not. I'm not saying to you guys personally. I'm just saying to anyone. Oh, oh, yeah. Okay. No. All right. I'm with that. I'm ready that. to answer it for me personally. No. Uh, <laughs> I think it's fucking great that you you're bold enough to fucking go out there and say that. And it was funny when Kobe was like, "Let them uh, handle it amongst themselves." But anyhow, I think it's fucking great that you fucking um uh, and and nobody should have anything to say with what comes out of your mouth. You know what I'm saying? It's your fucking mouth. And um yeah, man, people are gonna judge you. So fucking yeah, go hard, bro. Yeah, and we're go not here to hard. like censor any comics or tell them what they can and cannot oh, no, say. No, no, no. We're just giving impressions on what we felt while in the room and what we've heard on the streets. You know? Oh man, I've I've seen the looks. See, the best thing about stand up <laughs> is there'll be there's two types of comics, and these are good the, ones I love and the bad first ones. ones. <laughs> <laughs> well, you got no, you got this is after a good set, right? right. Yeah, no, a good set that's cool. Everybody's blowing smoke with your ass, but a bad set you got two types of comics. Yeah, they got the ones who say, "Hey, good set," and those people should be stabbed in the fuck head. those yeah. people. But you got the real comics who just won't make eye contact, and you're like, "All right, that's all my right. guy right there." He didn't even make eye contact. He looked the other way and kept walking. I know like how a, like I a did. bad sexual encounter. I yeah. like to rub it in. That's that's what I like to do. When mm. you do a bad set, I like to rub it in a little bit, throw a little salt on the wound. It makes you tougher. You gotta you gotta revel in failure, I think. So what do you, you guys think get about uh, Kevin Clapman? Kevin. Oh, Clapman. we're moving on now. We're moving on Kevin to the Clapman. Well, rather, we gotta get to it. Yeah, that motherfucker was funny as fuck. He was funny. Although I will say this: was that an act? Yes, of course it was an act, dude. I mean, was oh, he really yeah. picking up the fucking? He was picking up uh, the mic stand. Mic stand like he that was purposely on purpose? not. Yeah, and he kneeling was down like that. Yes, he got tired though because his fucking back. You can you can only stand that position for so long. This motherfucker was like, "Fuck it, I'm picking it up." If he that was an act, he stayed in character really well. He did. I think that was pretty. Uh, yeah, good. he did. Yeah, he was pretty funny. Dude. Yeah, he did. I think that in the interview portion, he should have just gone real, been himself. Right. Been himself. I mean, I don't know about that though. He was hilarious. Though. Yeah. He, yeah. At one minute, though, it was. He just, was, was really good. Yeah. Like, he was really good. And no, he was he's funny. been doing it for what five years. Yeah. Yes. Okay. So yeah, he was pretty good. Yeah. You could tell he's Denver. fucking put his work in. Yeah, I yeah. blame Tony. He made the interview too long. I thought like for him playing the character like that, he should have wrapped up the interview a little bit sooner, and it would have been a perfect. Well, I was wondering set. if if he was gonna try to break him and out of character. You know, yeah. Steve O tried to. Steve O tried, and the guy. See, that's why I know he it was wasn't an act, budging. Because the guy was like, "Is this?" He went flaccid. Yeah, he went. He went <laughs> you touched your lips. <laughs> flaccid. Ah, I love it. I love it. Anyhow, yeah, he was funny. My my issue with uh, character comics is like how you know how long is that sustainable? Maybe forever. Yeah, you I can mean, see he was it. good. He was good. Yeah. Okay. Fuck it. He was good. Yeah, I thought he was funny. I thought he was really funny. Yeah, he was very funny. And then his follow up, Jacob Cowley, was horrible. <laughs> well, you know the That's poacher, the, uh, poacher, the, the poacher, poacher yeah. dude. That was Trump so. Jokes that was so weird. And a yeah. Hurricane H Harvey kid name. So he talked about baby names. I've actually dealt with this. Not that we named our kids after natural disasters, but the biggest arguments my wife and I get into are names for our kids. Okay. I get so stressed out about it. But his set Are was not funny. Having more kids soon. I was confused by the <laughs> motives. Like you've never done stand up for the last ten years. You go to talk right. to Steve O about poaching, and then uh, Steve O gives a PSA about animal rights. Animal rights. Yeah, right. I had a in a well, comedy show. It was confusing. Well, well, he's an activist, so he's Steve O. Abraham, activist. don't yeah, make stories for him because he's famous. No, and he, he wanted is. No, to he do is. Stuff. He's an activist. Okay, well, he regardless, said. I don't give a fuck if you're an activist or a vegan or whatever you are. Right. It's not your time to talk about right. that. Well, I mean, okay? I mean, he's a guest, so not your time to do your stand up right. here. You're right. He's gonna plug. It's not your time to talk about your beliefs on that. It was it was connected. But it was I would weird. Like to talk about yeah, it was God connected. Right now. You know, it he, was weird. Yeah. He, uh, Do you want to talk about the <laughs> LSD know? phase? There was a connection Travis. there. There was a connection there, and he just brought it up. You know, he talked about it. It was interesting. Yeah, but do you think it was? I think it was, it was, think it was fine. Yeah. What you think about it? Planned? No. I mean, I think there was. I not mean, planned collusion. Like that, but Let's just not forget collusion. Let's just, that's all. Said collusion. <laughs> yeah. Conspiracy theories right? coming collusion. out. Let's yeah. just not forget that collusion is a word because it does happen. Collusion. All right. All right. Collusion. So Jacob Cali was a was a. I plant. just thought it was weird. So he, he, he did look Russian. <laughs> I just 
<laughs> right? looked weird. It seemed uh, weird. It was really awkward in the room. And then Steve-O even made a comment and said, uh, after all this, it's not even funny in here anymore. Right? Yeah. He did yeah. say yeah. that. Because you that fucked up the vibe, Steve-O. Well, yeah, I don't know if Steve-O did, did <laughs> but Jacob Cowley kind of did. I think it was confusing. Why is he hanging with poachers? Is he trying yeah. to like... And he's been doing it that for three years weird. and is still going back. Is he back redeeming and them? And or is he and why to did he dress him? like fucking Where's Waldo join the Crips? Did he? I thought he looked like Ben Savage a bit. He knew that Steve-O <laughs> you know was going to be about? there. He knew Steve-O was going to be there, That's so I think I mean. he purposely went there. That's of course he did. Yeah, he of course he did. Destiny, he got called up. Yes. So, you know, that's what it is. Maybe it was. So I meant like I don't think it was, it was mine. Like, a, oh. like, oh, right. Steve-O's going to be here. So right. you know what I'm going to do? Yeah. I'm going to go to that Kill Tony show. I'm going to put my name in the yeah. bucket. I thought like it was that. interesting how in Joelberg, they fucking jacked his fucking car for being a dumbass. What? Oh, you you're not talking about Joel Jimenez. No, you're not Joel about Jimenez. And Joel, place. the gentleman, they yeah. fucking oh, they, yeah, they yeah, stole yeah, yeah. his car. The fucking his cameraman, cameraman from South Africa. South Africa. What the fuck? So that was weird. I don't know. He sounds like he deserved it. Okay, yeah. Brandon Jordan. <laughs> oh, him. Oh yeah, he bombed. He bombed hard. I mean, yes. I know he's a talented comic. The the ten thousand dollar guy. Yeah. <laughs> they told him, yeah, you know, it was a regulated minute, right? This fool went like a minute and forty seconds. Which I thought that was fucking cool because, uh, yeah, it was just an elongated fucking joke. Yeah. yeah. Uh, Red Band gave him, like, the triple fucking... Uh, oh, no, he shot him, did he? Yeah, he yeah. shot him. They clowned him hard that they shot him that to shoot yeah. his ass. And he's been guy. doing comedy for 12 years, so you would think that, fuck, dude, you, you, you've been doing comedy for 12 fucking years, brother, and you can't do a fucking minute? Dude, everyone Just to let you know, Dante, night, you Abraham. can say whatever you feel as well. You I, have like, your but voices <laughs> heard here. How can you do... <laughs> That's a crazy. That's a loaded uh, to do a minute though. That's crazy. Minutes are tough. You're right because I yeah. I understood where his his crucial problem wasn't that he. It's that it was a minute. It's like what the fuck do I do in a minute? That's the that's the thing. It's like hey, what do you do with a minute? You know yeah. What I mean? No, it's he tough. He didn't get what he did with a minute, but it's still a minute. Travis hates it, so he left. Look, what's I a mean, minute. <laughs> well, <laughs> no, a minute, a minute. Yeah. Look at the guy, the first Dude, guy. Dude, you at Travis Kevin, walk out. Kevin no, 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 no. went up there Second in a minute guy and fucking boom, 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 down boom, your boom, boom, in a minute. So, I mean, <laughs> for 12 years, if you can't fucking do a minute and break your jokes onto a minute, I mean, I mean, there's different styles of comedy, but fuck, you already know what you're getting yourself into. You come to the Kill Tony, you get a minute. Why go up there and fucking do a long ass story rescue. that's gonna take longer than a minute? You know the setup was too long. You know he just he uh, just wasn't. Yeah. You know he, he should he and it, for for it being his third time going up there, you would have thought, okay, I'm gonna be ready. But some people just aren't ready. You know what I'm saying? That's but they did say uh, Baloney Pete did say that he had a nice butt, and that his butt was nicer than his comedy. So that was that there was go. fun. There you go. I mean, everybody has an off night, right? This guy yeah. had an off night. I think is all. And the and next guy that uh, went up. Was the next Sarah. lady. The next lady. <laughs> Sarah Lawrence. Is my mic working? I uh, I don't hear my mic. Is my mic working? Oh, okay, cool. If you're breathing, I thought you're it was going to be Seth because it has the same last name. As yeah, Seth. right. Yeah, I She's thought got it my was, last name. I thought well, when it was just said Lawrence, I thought oh, because the last Seth, time Seth just wrote his name is Seth's Seth. butthole puckered up was like mm, mm, mm. he was like ah oh, shit, and then he realized it was a woman, so Ooh. he got he was. Now okay. I knew what name I wrote down for myself. Right. So I knew it wasn't me. He got scared. He thought they were going to call you up there. I was ah. a little nervous. <laughs> I always get a little nervous. So Fuck Sarah yeah. was talking about sh uh, yeah. Seth in line. Talking yeah. shit on him. What I the caught heck her. What's that about? Sarah? So, Sarah my second wife? Sarah. Yeah. Caught her doing it. She said to her friend, Why does he always get to go in early? Jeez. And then she said, Oh, because he's with Aphrodite. That's jealousy. why. Jealousy. Fucking jealousy. Right yes, there. she did. What a fucking hey, piece. I Fuck heard you, you, bitch. Sarah. That's fucked up. You're all right. Sarah, You're all right, Sarah. we oh, like you. Man. but I I'm got <laughs> something down under for you, girl. Just kidding. Oh, my <laughs> word. That's oh, fucked up. But she was funny though. She she guy. was okay though. Wow. She was okay. High key, right? She guy. was okay. Um <laughs> or high key. I like how they kept giving her the high seal key. sounds. Do, do, do. What's that seal they sound? They didn't they give made? her the seal sounds. She got the seal sound the whole fucking show, bro. Was that she just made it like her head? Head? I didn't hear any seal oh, sounds yeah. during her set. I was set? listening. Fuck yeah. I was listening. She got no, a lot she of seal sounds. she talked about Snoop so, Dogg. Dude. Yeah. And that Snoop Dogg gave inspiration by saying, if you breathe, then you're, you should just be. If you're breathing, in, you're achieving. If you're breathing, you're achieving. Yeah. And, and yeah, Tony, Tony said exactly the problem with that joke. Right. 
picking on someone Snoop who's Dogg. a millionaire, multi multi millionaire. Yeah. Yeah. There's many things you can say about Snoop that aren't flattering, but the fact that he's not achieving something is not one of them. Yeah, he made yeah. the like, number one gospel album this his year. His advice to us and the number be one uh, crip is back. Crip in his back. Damn, this fool went for a Yeah, he did. A, he did a mixtape of that crip in his back, and then he did a gospel album inside the same calendar year. Wow. And they both did well. They both did well. Oh, nice. Number one on the gospel album. I don't Better know where Crippin is back. Album, right? And he's got the Martha Stewart show and the Joker's Wild show. Yeah. yeah so I miss Snoop I, Lion, personally. He is definitely a cloned human being. Yeah. Yeah, yeah. He's who's, a cheese a lot. Uh, who's Snoop Lion? Vince, Vince Marita. For real? Yeah. I don't know. Snoop Lion? Was his alter ego for a while? Yeah, yeah. he, he did a reggae Africa album. Come on, get with it. The Eric. reggae oh, community, I don't, I don't think took took him. I know him, that. Uh, Look how white I am, and I know that. Take him too well. Aggressively yeah. white. I don't know. Anywho, sorry. <laughs> sure. uh, I can't Sarah, know everything. you suck for talking smack on me. So uh, peace. I don't think she meant it in a mean way. I know she's just jealous. Vince yep. Marita. Well, they just don't got it. They just don't got it. Vince Marita to do it like that. All right, well, we should probably swap guests because yeah. we need to get for the latter half of the show. We have a special. Oh, we do guest. have a special guest, Devonte, dude. Thank you. Can, uh, uh, you thanks for coming on, man. Word, man. Hey, man, you can't win them all <laughs> or any. <laughs> Bro, you All fucking right, won. Right, In my eyes, you won, bro, and you won this I love one. It. Just the fact that you got up there, you're a fucking winner. Believe that. Yeah. Yeah, that's for sure. Yeah, well, thanks for coming on the show, man. I appreciate you. you. Devontae, appreciate it. Thank you guys it, for having me. Have yourself? a good night, everybody. Take it easy. Peace. Ooh. Do we have any comments while we swap out? Oh, yeah, you out could uh, follow me on Instagram. Oh, oh yeah, yeah, wait, we hold need on. to get Instagram. these two uh, people inside the same shot because uh, I want to prove that they're not the same person. Oh, oh my yes. God! Can I, get, can I plug kills? my? Uh, can I plug my? Uh, yeah, absolutely. plug your Instagram. Before I go, guys, it's uh, Come in. Instagram and Twitter is at Devonte Green. Uh, at Devonte Green. Spell that. D e v o n t a e. D-E-V-O-N-T-A-E. Yeah. Green like the color. No e on the end because we can't afford an extra vowel. Ow, right, guys, have a good night. Thank you for having me. It was a pleasure. Thank that will be inside thanks, the comments as well. Don't follow that yet. man. Follow that man. Give him some love. All right, Love so it. look, they're both oh, yeah, here. Let's Wait. show. We want to show that you know you two are. The they same. see it. They see it. Oh, can they, they see it? Yeah. Okay, they're not. I mean, so they're not the same person. Oh my gosh! I just wanted to prove how, that point. How racist are we getting on the show? <laughs> it's not racist. <laughs> oh, black faces and racist. I, I thought. Do my life? Does anybody see what I got to do in my life? My lantern. <laughs> <laughs> All right, all right. Man. Sorry. The creature is here. The creature in the house. Oh, here we got, I'll share with here. You can have your own mic. We got him. We got no kills. Vo kills. Vo kills. Vo kills. Welcome yeah. to the recap. Welcome yeah. to the recap. Yeah. yeah. Yo, what the fuck is up, creatures? How you guys feeling? <laughs> yeah. Feeling good, brother. Can you hear him on that? All fuck right. yeah. All right. <laughs> Sick. I'm really glad to be here. Thank you guys. Woo. Tonight was legendary, and. It's literally all faith. This was all meant to happen, and it was crazy how. Yeah. <laughs> Fucking Destiny. tonight was sick, dude. Like honestly, I spent my last hour coming here hoping that this would work out, and it, it really did, you know. And um, linking with homie Stevo, shout out to Stevo once again. Oh yeah. Fucking, it was dope, you know. And. Can you yeah. hit him with that Billy? That sound effect that made the Billy? Hell yeah, we in the Billy in this bitch. <laughs> Oh Let's fucking go! How's everybody? That's eardrum? fucking right! <laughs> Whoa! <laughs> we in that shit. Oh my gosh, we're gonna lose control. I fucking love I that shit. I just fucking broke into a mini seizure. <laughs> Fuck yeah! <laughs> yes! <laughs> Thank you. Oh, I'm sweating. I shit. Have headphones on. Oh my god. Okay, so you came love, on the oh, show, shit. and we're skipping. This was he was the last. Um, he was the last. He closed out the show. But yeah, so, so, so we're gonna we're, we're gonna skip, and we're gonna talk about the last comic. Then we'll Come go on. back to the list. So. Well, Oh, here's the thing. Vince Marita. Yeah, so we're, we're, we're going to Vince Marita. The, the, yeah, the guy that we'll was first time doing comedy. Okay, fine, 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 fine. We'll get into the story. Funny, after. Clever, it was his first time. Yes. First time? I mean, you killed it, bro. Yeah. First yes. time? That was solid. Talking about pulling things out of his ass, masturbating to kill Tony wow. to Tony Hinchcliffe. He loved that. He got it. You know yeah. what I'm saying? I don't know. I think that joke could have gone two ways because it was either Tony putting stuff up his bum or he was putting stuff up his bum i think he was tony, just talking about yeah. like tony was talking shit or he was gonna talk shit about his set and was kind of like throwing that out there before tony could talk some shit so yeah. he did like a little psychology know. move it worked out though it worked out regardless Keep it of up, what was man. intended yeah good job he was, was funnier than most people i'll tell you that yeah 
very strong. most comics That's that I've true. seen go up there. And he kept it. Re- I mean, he talked about his, tr- you know, what happened to him in real life. Dude, that that's fucking cool. sucks. His fucking lady left, his, fucked his best friend or whatever. Tried. Yeah, that sucks. Tried. Yeah. I mean, what was wrong Shout with her that, that lady. the friend didn't do it? <laughs> Fuck you for cheating on him, bitch! Fucker! <laughs> you fucking whore. hook ass bitch! Wow. Hopefully don't get mad. I don't give a shit wow. if she gets mad. <laughs> she was a whore. She maybe maybe his friend was lying, though. <laughs> Yeah, you know, maybe. Maybe the maybe. friend was lying. Maybe they did fuck. Here's, Who here's knows? Here's what I was confused about, okay? And uh, Vince, hit me up on this. Because why didn't they ask you? You talked with her about having an open relationship, and then you punished her for acting on the open relationship? Dude? Yeah, it was her idea. Dude? It was her idea. No, it was his idea, No, it was dude. her idea. No. He was just open to it. Nah. No. Yeah, he was trying idea. to push the threesome, <laughs> and then Rewind. she was like, all yeah. right. Rewind. Bring another dick back. in the room. Can I tell you? He a lot brought of it up. That I do know about it bit him in the butt. Those kinds of things. I, I'm a, I'm pr- pretty much a wizard in that area. Okay. Oh. And let me tell you how that usually goes. Men are like, oh, are you comfortable with the threesome? Because they want to bring another girl in. What yeah. happens is they don't prepare for when a girl's like, oh yeah, yeah. I'll take some more dick. Thanks. I know this dude. No, yeah, that was her idea to fuck around with another no, dude. It Abraham. wasn't. No. I, that's what I got. Entertained, entertained, introduced the idea with her. Hey, honey, you want to maybe have a threesome? Are you open to like have oh. an open get in relationship? Okay. Have an open relationship? And she then was like, took it as sure. Let's Freaking do yell. this thing, but I'm gonna suck <laughs> some extra dick. Okay. Boom. And he was trying to get some poom tang. And it didn't yes. work out. Oh. <laughs> yes. And then, do you know how to spell? Awesome. What is happening right now? <laughs> I'm just trying to spell it out. All I wanted to know is did any of Somebody didn't clean off? out their ears today. Oh, my. Yeah. All His right. So let's just Abraham talk about Boche. William Montgomery real quick. Yeah. All right. He ate a bag of dicks tonight. Tony kept him up. Oh, boy. He hoisted him up. He kept him up like the little puppet that oh he is. Oh, boy. Oh, oh boy. Oh, boy. And he let that motherfucker kill. Oh but boy. he didn't kill shit. Oh, boy. He did the I, same shit, another joke about his fucking family, and it oh was a boy. lame joke. Oh, boy. He didn't even get the outburst in this time. Fuck William Montgomery. He's an improv actor <laughs> acting like a stand-up comic. He's oh not no. a fucking stand-up comic. The roast battle is real. The roast battle is real. Are you going to respond Fuck yeah. to Copus Millennium? You're Fucking a loser, dude! <laughs> oh no! William Montgomery, nice. that is not nice. You disrespect comics. Come here at the fourth wall, and you have to get kicked out because you oh, can't gosh. even fucking listen through their sets. You oh, fucking gosh. piece of shit! Fuck you, William oh, Montgomery! Yeah, what the fuck, William? Who, Willie, we who on the bitch? Okay, <laughs> for the record, I like how Yo, I'm just saying he's a piece of shit. I like <laughs> how not that funny. I like how Baloney. I like how Baloney Pete said he looked like an adult orphan. Yes, that was a good little roast. Dude, the whole time I thought it was Blow Me Pete. Copus is into it. You had better accept his challenge, (laughs) William. William, just do it. Just do the roast battle. You can beat him, and then it'll be over, you know? Come on. You're going to fucking lose. They asked him him if you ever had a wet dream, and he just could not answer that? It's a yes or no. Have you had a wet dream? I've had a wet dream. I've had it like twice. For yeah. me only. Dude, here's the thing. He never bro? keeps yeah, it real. William Montgomery never says one real thing. Yeah. Real life. And that's bro, I the issue. my pants oh, doing shit. that shit. <laughs> Tony what says if you want to kill on, uh, kill Tony, just be honest dreamer. and keep it real. And he never says one fucking real thing. That is true. Fuck yeah. him. Yeah. And that is probably <laughs> the downfall for tonight, I think. He said his... He, <laughs> I mean, right. come on. He he. Okay, he he's original. Come here. He said he had a dream. His grandma was on the bottom bunk bed, and then she ended up on the top bunk bed. Dude, so he says outrageous shit. I know, but he just says outrageous <laughs> shit. He says outrageous yes. shit. Yes, he, he says, does. I think Go he's to funny. the UCB, motherfucker. You know what I think he did? You watched the Grandma's Kisses video of SpongeBob. That's where you deserve to right? go. Go to the UCB. Oh, play no. with the improv. Grandma's Kisses. Remember that shit, bro? Grandma's <laughs> Kisses. All right. That's like enough that. on William. He's yeah. a talented William comic. Montgomery. He had a rough night. We love you, bro. Lots of rough Sorry, buddy. We love you. We just got our weird way of showing it. I love you. Gosh, we're going to keep this moving. We're going to get hate mail. I like hate mail. And then we ended with Vokills. Vocals. Yeah. He's Vocals. bringing true insanity to the stage. Wait, hold on one second. Hold on one second. Just before we get to him, All right, what was they, your remember note? they asked James Bita? It yes. didn't work out the way we we wanted to because the guy he he I think he tried to set it up, but he it found, just fucking backfired. Well, his well. friend found the prior Kill Tony episode where everything was revealed, 
and his friend didn't want to go on air having the discussion. How did I he can find understand the that. Well, episode? No, no, that's yeah. not what happened. That's not what happened. What happened was he was trying to get it set up, so he told him, "Hey, um, I want you, I'm doing this podcast. They want to talk to you about your music." And the guy was like, "No, I don't want to do that." But then he ended up telling him, "Hey, there's something I have to tell you, and I want to do it on air." And the guy was like, "No, I'm not having it." What happened is James Bita is a selfish motherfucker, and he should have done that here on the recap show so everyone could see it in the same fucking night That's in a true. sequence when we oh, asked him to. Yeah. Instead, he wanted to keep it going for Save a week, and of course Kill someone Tony. found out. Of course <laughs> someone <laughs> found out. It's been on the internet for a whole fucking dude, week. James Beat off. Man, you James are beat off. off the hook. Beat beat off. Off, dude. You got beat off the show, James. I love it. Fuck, you could Damn. have been a Kill Tony legend, bro. Damn. Yo, if, any, if anything, you could have just faked it and was like, yeah, have someone else act like he was the dude, call him up. And that's what like, we tried yeah. to do. Yeah, that's, yeah, that's what, what we, we want is I more fake stuff. Yeah, reason. she said no. We were going to do that. I wasn't going to answer. Yeah, hell yeah. You lie. fuck my bitch. No, but James, <laughs> you were here you. last week. We asked you to do it here on the recap show, but you wanted to save it for a week. I and now you yeah. blew in the whole load and it fucking was masturbation okay. it was all masturbation there was no fucking all penetration right. that's all that was <laughs> all right just so like then the Volk way he kills uh, <laughs> right yeah. he never Volk actually kills. he never Volk actually kills. penetrated kills. that's for last week's show yeah. Yeah. then we had Vo kills fuck Volk yeah kills. the star of the so, show fucking yeah dude. Star of the show. <laughs> okay fuck, yeah. fuck is up creatures so when i heard you i yelled so talented that is that is what i have in my notes wow so talented fuck yeah okie dokie that's all I wrote. She did not lie. That's all well, she wrote. She spelled vocals with an S, which I'm not mad at the Z, but I, don't know how to spell I still love you guys. It's okay. <laughs> <laughs> how would you? <laughs> Plurals are always with a Z. So vocals did a combination did of death metal, rap, and it. comedy oh, yeah. inside one minute, which was very uh, breathtaking. Ambitious. Ambitious. Yes. And I then, love this confidence. You oh, came yeah. with a fucking mission. So what was the yeah. mission? Okay, so now you got time. Let it all out, bro. So check this out. Um, about like two two years ago, a year and a half at the Helium Club, Steve will performed because I'm initially from Buffalo, New York. Shout out to you creatures from uh, Riverside. So he came to the Helium Club and like not too many things come to Buffalo. So this was a big deal. It's fucking Steve-O, you know what I mean? So I went there with the intentions of giving him my CD so he would listen to it. Now the show ended. He came off stage. I gave him the CD, but it really didn't seem like it gave a flying fuck. So I was like, Shocker. fuck this shit, bro. You're listening to my music. Otherwise, I'm going to force you to fucking listen to this shit. So I went up to security and told him the plan for so that way we didn't get arrested. Even though we went there with, you know, probably we were going to get arrested. So I told him, like, listen... We just watched Steve-O perform. We're going to perform for fucking Steve-O. So my homies from the SWA, shout out to Chaz Stoll and fucking Darren Robotoy, they came with us and um, they fucking, they did some wrestling while I went up there with the speaker and I was like, this is for fucking Steve-O motherfuckers. Get in this shit with the whipped and cryptic motherfucking bitch shit. And you can find this shit on Facebook. Just type in Vokills like Steve-O, Buffalo, New York. You've seen that? And um, <laughs> yeah, my buddy got choke slammed right in front of Steve-O and I was screaming tales from the hood in the speaker and security guard was like, yo, 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 yo. He was trying to cut this shit off and then Steve-O was like, nah, dude, this shit's badass. And like, we fucking did it. It was legendary and now... That inspired me to keep going, and I, you know, like I said, this was about a year ago, two years ago now, and in the meantime of that, inspired me so much that I did not fucking stop. It's a full force burning circle wheel. I fucking went in there. We got on Taj Point oh, ridiculousness. Uh, I came out here for another show. Um, I came out here for American Idol, but um, I can't talk too much about that. But now the next move is America's Got Talent. So I actually came out here to see if he would like to be a part of that, and um, we will be seeing this motherfucker again tomorrow. So you will be seeing more of me. And yeah, you know, my homie Kellen, shout out to Kellen Pembleton. Wait, you're finding Steve O tomorrow? Yeah. Is that what gonna, you're saying? Yeah, that's the that's him. the only weird part to me. He's determined. Is that you're like chasing Steve O down when I think you're a talented yeah. young man. Yeah. And I'm glad Maybe you went to way. kill Tony. But I don't think you need Steve O. I mean, you had a cool moment with him, but I don't think you need Steve O to In your act. do yeah. your thing. Nah. You're it, bro. In fact, he would detract. Right? Yeah. I mean, if you're you guys want to be the star. I'm gonna play Simon Cowell right now. Okay. Why would you want a huge star with you? If to be you honest, be the star. It's not even to boost myself up. It's to fucking help him out and like. If Steve you doesn't yeah. need your help. True. Well, it would. Whoa. It would if you think Steve about it. Steve don't need you. Tell him, I mean, bro. it's 150 more million views. You know, he say okay. For example, if he were to put something out right now, and no offense to you, buddy. You get probably like two, three million. That fucking show gets like 150 plus million fucking views. You're in front of Howard Stern, Howie Mandel. Boom. Mandown, Here's worldwide. the thing. No, Banks, no, 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 no. Steve-O is beyond that, right? Um, I, mean, I mean, that's a discovery show. You're on a discovery show. That's how you get found. Steve-O, 
You've been found, dog. Steve-O has right? his own audience. I don't think he wants to cater to middle America. Yeah. I just don't think that he wants that sort of audience. Volsko's got he's got he's got an idea. He's got I like a plan. Your dream. I, he's got a I vision. Don't think, I like and the I vision. I think it's a great idea. And if I you like can get Steve O to do it, it would do benefit Steve O. Yeah. 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 yeah, I don't I don't think it's you true. need Steve O to you're so talented that you don't need like, him. Like what do you need him for? Yeah, I don't think he already liked your stuff and yeah. you have video footage yeah. with him, but you're your own person entity and yeah. your own creature. Creature and your own stuff. And so you should just continue your journey, yeah. and you'll make it on yeah. your without. You know he what I'm saying? He would and detract. then you know what will be great is when he's knocking on your door asking you to do yes. something <laughs> with him. Yes. That's there you what go. you want. Yeah. Yes, you go. both you know skills. I mean? That's what I see. Yeah. That's what I see. Whether he I does mean. or doesn't do this with you, I think that when you it comes full it circle, still. that oh, time will come. That time will come. Kellen has something to say. Shout out to Danny fucking Duncan. Who the heck um, is that? So my homie Kellen put me on to him. This dude's fucking Danny rad. Duncan. He's going viral, a very, very big YouTuber. And um, it was he, really a big play opportunity Fortnite? to... What does he do? I think he does play Fortnite, actually. All right. Um, in the uh, John Cena video, he actually picked up the book and was like, you know, you can buy some merch here and shit. But fucking, like, I'm pretty sure he does play yeah. it. I've never played the game, but I could definitely tell. I mean, what, what is he Fortnite. famous for? Why is he going viral? Do you want to? You wanna Can we get a shout out to, to Kellen? Come, yeah. on, come over come here. here oh, yeah, Kellen. Get shout out to a good friend. Get the live action cameraman. This motherfucker is the reason why I'm surviving out here in, L in LA, Hollywood. Seriously, shout out to Kellen. Hey. Hi, Kellen. How you doing? What's up? Okay, well, you tell us your story, I guess. Tell us about what's his name? Kellen? No, not your <laughs> name. Danny Duncan is <laughs> just. Danny Duncan. This Danny really Duncan. funny guy. He goes by Gary Winthorpe. Too close. Oh. <laughs> 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 yeah, it's a different talent for a different setting. Danny Duncan is this really funny YouTuber. <laughs> okay, and he was on his video. Gotcha. Yeah. All right, yeah, all right. <laughs> yeah, we'll put the links um, inside the um, comment section. Okay, sure, the description. Uh, v o k i l l z is how you spell Volkills. You can find me anywhere. Just type it in um, at Volkills. My real name's Ethan. Um, but seriously, shout out to Easy. Taj.0, oh, because this is where it actually all started. Uh, I actually went viral for doing Daniel a huge Taj. fat rail of fucking cocaine. I did the loudest pterodactyl scream. This, and this was that fucking... Oh, we already uh, heard yeah, it. We, we already heard it. We already heard it. Want to hear it again, though? Just, yes. No. All right, the mummy's coming no. out of the tomb right now. <laughs> oh, wow. It didn't peak? You That's fucking you bro. You freaking suck, suck shit, dude. Bro. No, Mystic Death. <laughs> <laughs> that's an alien sound, bro. Oh my god, yeah, that's fucking oh, amazing. Alien alien contact and Hell yeah. Now, now, um, is there anything that you're trying? Yeah, the animal. Yeah. yeah. It, All right, we're just having a I, private I just, conversation. Just want, yeah. <laughs> when he did that pterodactyl sound, did you guys see Aphrodite? She was like, <gasps> <laughs> Aphrodite doesn't care Bo about this. Vocals. I I want to know besides she Steve, is there mate. anyone else here in LA that you're trying to um, bum rush? Uh, connect with <laughs> Bum Rush. Well, um, what's your next mission, dog? That's what I want to know. You're yeah. here. You're in L.A. What's the next step for you? To be a are star. You doing, are you doing comedy? Are you doing music? Are I you want, trying to do both? What's happening? Yeah, because I want to. I think it, it's all combined in one. To be honest, yes. I'm just being myself. You're an I'm entertainer. A creature. Yeah, I'm a little. He wants a to be an American, American vocalist. He wants to be an American Idol. American creature. American creature. And um, Idol. so my next goal really is to tour. You know, like I said, I can't really talk too much about American Idol. I came here for that. That's really all I can say. But um, I'm really trying to tour. You know, shout out to Carnifex, which is my favorite band. I got to go on stage with them recently for the Hell Closer. Show with me breakdown. Closer. And um, <clears throat> yeah, I'm just trying to get the music out there. Because long story short, I went viral on Taj for doing the line, and it got a billion views. Everyone stole the video, watermarked it, gave me no credit, and you can hear my fucking name in the video right before I do the screech. And nice. it's, I'm really trying to get that billion into the music because I'm, I'm a musician. But uh, when Kellen put me on to Kill Tony, and I've been watching it, and I've been really getting into it. So I'm like, you know what? I'm gonna go here, and I'm gonna try my best. And that's pretty much what my goal is. Everywhere I go, I just try to entertain people and let them know even if they don't like vocals they fucking know about vocals and the creatures risen and um yeah i just want to fucking make people smile and i want to get everyone involved so bring up steve -O again you know, like i don't care if it helps me at all i don't really need it i just i want to i want to help him as he helped me because yeah. he really did inspire me yeah. if you guys look up vocals like steve -O, nice. he um it, you know it was dope and he even gave me a cool little speech he says no matter what you want in the world you just do whatever you fucking want and yep. it'll happen you're gonna do a good job and like you know that's fucking steve -O, you know Sure. Can you drop some fast bars for us real quick? Hell oh, yeah. Boy. So I usually scream over the beat, but I'll do like, Rub on the block with the grams on the sack and the bitches be wishing they suck in the cock cause the motherfucking bitches be looking like dots. Whoa. <laughs> Rough from the land of the profits to cop drop top lot now. Watch those fucking dollars drop to nothing. Summer everything, do bits and pieces. Fuck the police. <laughs> 
Yeah. Okay. Thank you. That's some <laughs> like wild that shit. Part. Yeah, fuck the police. Fuck the police. All right, y'all. So we're really curious about what y'all think about this show. Um, definitely leave some comments if yes. you want to reach out to Bo right. Kills. We'll have his Bo information. Kills. Travis yeah. almost fell on his face. Definitely follow <laughs> Devonte. Do we have any comments, Travis, or is everyone oh, sleeping? Also, before we head out, I have a new music video dropping tonight with Dag Fierch from Rob mm. Zombie's Halloween in Hancock. This motherfucker's awesome. I look up to him as well, and it was really, really fucking awesome. Making How can they find it? Where can they find it? Uh, it's called Devil's Lettuce, Vokil's X Great Dag. Great Dag. And um, yeah, you'll find it YouTube, Spotify, Apple Music, iTunes, fucking Facebook, Face Fuck, everywhere in the world. It's going to be there. We're big up in the block with the gun in the second. You know what I mean? It's fucking website. fast bars. Talking about weed. Um, Devil's, <laughs> Devil's Lettuce? Devil's, Devil's fucking Lettuce. Nice. Is that a play on Toss Salad or what? It is a um, tetrahydrocannabinol mm, like type meal in a fucking transferic beat that has heavy fucking fast hitting 808s. I have no idea what any of that. I know classic <laughs> classic rock. Is that classic rock? Is it close? Uh, it's the next Bohemian Rhapsody. Kind of like Slayer. Fuck yeah. Shout out to Slayer. Slayer! You didn't even like that. I knew oh, it yeah. in my heart. Fuck yeah. <laughs> and Cannibal Corpse. Oh, my gosh. And Andy fucking Williams, dude. Fucking All right. Let's let uh, William Montgomery send in the hate mail to uh, we love you, William. recap. We love I you, buddy. you, Willie. <laughs> we love you, bro. Uh, and uh, Sarah, Hell if you yeah. want to get in early, you know, you got you to gotta freaking just walk through. No, he's got to have some fucking balls and know what yeah, the fuck you're doing, man. Just say you got to go to the nice bathroom to and, and fucking walk and straight into the fucking room. <laughs> I don't know. Just stop dressing like a bum, Sarah. Show your tits a little bit more. Oh, You'll my get God. Out of fucking titties oh, my there. God. Damn, <laughs> sick ass burn. Me too. Me too. <laughs> Fuck yeah. Okay. Uh, I'm just kidding. I fucking love y'all both. I love all the comics, you know? I love the Kill Tony experience. Fuck yeah. I got to say my piece, though, and I think William's just getting away with murder. So if I'm the only one that's going to say it, then yeah. fuck me. All but, right. you know, everyone's thinking it. I hear people talking <laughs> about it. So Well, if he's getting whatever. away with murder, he is supposed to he's kill Tony, Tony. So hell yeah, as long as he's killing Tony, he is getting away mwah, with murder. Mwah. More kisses for the asshole. Mwah. That was the... <laughs> That was the behind oh, the scenes. Oh, Fuck Abraham, that. just lick that That's fucking William Montgomery thing. redneck asshole. Get in there. Get bitch? in there. Exclusive well, sound bites from behind the scenes. That's the sound he's Tony. making. He's spitting cum out of his fucking cheetah chode. Cheetah chode. Jimmy Chunga. That hit it. it. <laughs> Ever since you broke up with, uh, what's my call? What's his name? Yeah, that oh. part. Could you grow up? Uh, are we done? Are we done? That's it. Oh, yeah. We got to give away a war. Does he? Yeah. For originality, I would not give it, just so our right. voice can be heard, I would not yeah. give it for the comedy. No. Not for right. comedy. I, I give yeah. it just for, for being outstanding. I mean, no extraordinary. What I don't know. Do the star. My, getting in there. My vote is for Kevin Clatman. Okay. If that's how you even say your last name, dog. I couldn't tell if it was Clapman or Clatman, but Kevin would take my vote. That's who took my vote. You're gay. Or I'd say, hey, wow. I got the clap, man. I am gay. I think Kill Tony you. is a show about Whatever. moments. James Bida got it last week because he created a crazy moment. Yes. And I think you created the best yes. moment of the week. That's just my opinion. Thanks, creature. I agree. It was what you do with it, right? Him him and uh fucking the homie Devante. Yeah, Devante shout out to Devante. Had a fucking moment too, and you know, he came over here and he owned it. He wanted to commit suicide right before we ran into him. We're like, no, bro, you did great. Come on, you're fine. I think car. he's one of the most likable people I've yes. ever seen in my he's life. He's quite a character. He's, he's just fucking so funny fucking as likeable, fuck. So it's easy to slam on someone that likable, I think. Yeah, he's a cool guy. Indeed. Fuck well, yeah. it was fun, guys. Yeah, it was fun. Thanks, you two, for coming on the show tonight. Yes. Appreciate your time. You guys are fucking amazing. Yeah, Keep it up. So Keep up the good work. Thank you, Travis. 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 The, the fourth wall in the house, baby. All right, guys. Travis. Sleep tight. Oh, yeah. The fourth wall. All right.